different molecules move with different velocities if c1 c2 c3 dot 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 cn are the velocities of n molecules of the gas individually their average velocity is given as c bar is equal to c1 plus c2 plus c3 plus dot 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 plus cn upon n as the molecules of the gas are continuously in random motion this average velocity is zero hence mean square velocity of the gas is calculated mean square velocity of gas molecules is the average of squares of velocities of the individual gas molecules it is denoted by c square bar so c square bar is equal to c1 square plus c2 square plus c3 square plus dot 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 plus cn square whole divided by n but the unit of mean square velocity will be meter square per second square and the unit of velocity should be meter per second hence root mean square velocity or rms velocity is defined and calculated rms velocity of gas molecules is the square root of the average of squares of velocities of gas molecules individually it is denoted by c hence c is equal to under root c1 square plus c2 square plus c3 square plus dot 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 plus cn square whole divided by n everything under root sign can be denoted by c square bar hence c is equal to under root c square bar squaring both sides we get c square is equal to c square bar the most important formula in the chapter is pressure exerted by the gas if p is the pressure rho is the density of the gas and c is the rms velocity of the gas molecules pressure exerted by the gas is given by the formula p is equal to 1/3 rho c square p is the pressure rho is the density and c is the rms velocity from this formula the rms velocity can be calculated as under root 3p by rho thus it appears that rms velocity is directly proportional to the pressure of the gas but it can be seen that as pressure of the gas increases according to boyle's law its volume decreases thus the ratio p upon rho remains constant for example if pressure of the gas is doubled its volume becomes one half and the density becomes double hence both pressure and density become double and the rms velocity remains constant hence another formula for rms velocity is used for one mole ideal gas the rms velocity is given by c is equal to under root 3 rt upon m where m is the molecular weight of the gas from the formula p is equal to 1/3 rho c square many things can be obtained such as with that formula you can verify boyle's law from that formula you get the average kinetic energy per unit volume ev as 3 by 2 p or average kinetic energy per mole em as 3 by 2 rt or average kinetic energy per molecule em as 3 by 2 kt hence students need to remember 
this formula P is equal to one third rho C square and different formulae obtained from that formula.